Three weeks left in the Canada West men's volleyball season for the Thompson Rivers University Wolfpack. They kicked off a three-game homestand Friday night at the Tournament Capital Centre as they took on the University of Winnipeg Westman. Wolfpack in black, Westman in white. TRU gets on the board first thanks to STP, Sam Taylor-Parks. TRU goes on a six-point run to open up the match. Randy Grunman gets the set on the left side and makes it 7-0. Winnipeg's big hitter is Casey Scouten. A little too much power, TRU takes the first nine points of the match. Up 10-1, a big double block by Tim Edge and Jordan Foote. Lots of enthusiasm for the black and orange. Later, Grunman up but faces a double block. It's 12-4 TRU. Tim Edge back in the TRU lineup after being sick last week. Shows no ill effects. Gets the point here. It's 14-8. Westman, though, cut the deficit to five thanks to Scouting with the big swing. It's 15-10. Later, the deficit is three before the pack regroup. Tim Edge with the kill. Six points for him in the first set. 22-19 TRU. The Westmen think they get the point here. Brandon Thielman along the line. It's out, though, and TRU wins the first set, 25-21. Second set, the teams begin to seesaw as they trade service errors. Here's Nolan Parrington of the Westmen, and the game is tied at seven. TRU leading 13-12 until this double block on Randy Grunman to tie things up. Later, Scouten gets the point, and we're deadlocked at 14. Westman up 23-21, it's that man Scouten, his 13th point of the match and makes it 24-21. After Scouten's service error keeps TRU around, it's not for long though as David Bomber's back gets the kill deep in TRU territory, they tie the match, it's 25-22. Third set, Westman ahead 15-9, Tim Edge coming up with a big hit as Winnipeg doesn't close down the net, it's 15-9 at that point. The Westman though pull ahead, Bomber's back, he has 11 on the night, 22-14 to score Winnipeg. Then Derek Jones down the middle for the point. Winnipeg captures the third set, 25-15. They lead the match 2-1. Fourth set, Winnipeg up 6-2. Bomber back with the block. He's got 13 points at this time. The pack hanging around. Anton Napolitano somehow makes the block. It's 9-3 Westman. And that seems to spur on TRU. Jordan Foote, seventh point of the night for the PG native. It's 9-4. With the score 11-4, Winnipeg gets foot again, cuts the deficit to six. Westman in control though, Brendan Thielman gets the kill. Winnipeg goes into the breakup 16-8. Down 21-14, it's STP for the pack. He winds up with nine points on the night. The Westman win on a play at the net in the middle. Winnipeg takes us at 25-14 and wins the match three to one. We expect a tough match from these guys, not surprised at all. They're, uh, they're, they're, uh have excellent players, and, and um, we, we expected a tough battle, so it was pretty much what we expected in the first set, and then we got some easier points as the match went on. I think we came up with the energy that we needed to. Uh, I think we had um, the right idea with our game plan on what they were going to do and how we could attack it, and then it kind of just fell apart the last couple of sets. And I think um, just mentally we kind of broke down, and it's tough. It's tough when another team kind of pushes back, but. We have a lot of guys that, that need to learn how to kind of sustain another team's pressure and then make their own push. Comment maybe a little bit on the plays of the middles, because I think on both sides, there's some key plays and some key points made in that area. Yeah, really in any match that we go in, we know that we're going to have uh, a strong presence in the middle with, whether it's SDP or, or Bird or Foot or, uh, or Dougie. Um, we know that has to be a focal point in our team, and I think we took a little too long to kind of get going in the middle in the offense. Um, and they did a good job, their, their two middles did a good job at forcing our middles to respect them so that they could set outside. Uh, obviously they're a fairly heavy outside team, like they set a lot of their offense to the outside, uh, but their middles did a good job at being efficient.